this is going to be a very simple search looking for patient zip codes for my patients from the last month then we're going to export that into Excel and use the Excel zip code data to plot out our patient demographics on Google Maps. So let's uh, drag in appointment provider from the lab section which has the appointment provider and zip code in the same metadata set. So I'll choose the last month. Uh, here's uh, all of the providers for the last month. I'll search for my own name. Just click on search. Uh, I pop up, check off my box. Now I just have my patients that are going to show up and we'll drag in zip code. So this provides me all the zip codes for all the patients that I've seen for the last month. The next step will be to get that into Excel. So I'm going to hold down on the control button and click view in Excel. That's going to uh, create the report again in Excel format. We'll click open. That's going to open Excel for me in a moment. Uh, and there now Excel's open. We need to clean up the data perhaps just a little bit by taking my name out. Uh, so we will uh, highlight that column and uh, clear that. We'll just cut or uh, delete all of that out. Uh, we'll take out the zip code uh, wording, take uh, this other extraneous material out, and then we'll save this file uh, as uh, just say zip code. So uh, I'll save it in my directory as zip code. Now we've got the file. So now let's go to uh, Internet Explorer or Firefox, whatever your choice is, and we'll go to uh, apps.google.com and go to Google Docs. We will uh, upload this uh, Excel file, so we'll choose Upload. Go to uh, Browse for my file that I just uh, exported from uh, Cogno CBO, and we'll upload the file. That just takes a moment because it's not a very big file. Uh, so we're done. We've already got the Google Docs here. And let's uh, insert a gadget. Insert gadget and we'll choose Maps. There's other gadgets you might want to play around with, but we'll add that to our spreadsheet. There we go. And we give uh, the script a little bit of time to load. Uh, we'll change the range here. It's the zip code data actually starts at A3, so let's change it from A3 to A63. So just those zip code data points, and I like the normal map better than the satellite or the hybrid map. So uh, let's see if uh, Camtasia will zoom out here for us in a second. It's kind of on autopilot. Now the zip codes that are zip plus four, which are nine digits, are going to look funny to uh, Google Maps, and they're going to be out in Europe. So you can clean those up first if you uh, if you care to. So let's try to center the map by clicking on one of the data points, and then we'll zoom in. And there we go. There's our region. I'll zoom in a little bit further, and uh, the, and these are all cities in the surrounding area around Amarillo. Um, there are some people that are seem to be in more outlying areas. Uh, but that's generally the distribution for our patients. We have some patients that are, say, uh, legacy patients that still come to see us from other places like Farmington and Corpus Christi. But there you go. Uh, you've got all of your lab data. Now, you could do street addresses, but I don't know if that would be kosher with uh, HIPAA. There you go.